we have created this false narrative that there is such a thing in the world called cyber risk. And I would posit there is no thing as cyber risk. It's a fiction. There is business risk. risk. When you look right. at a result of a cyber event or a breach, we don't talk about, like some of us talk about the technical fiddly bits, the board, the executives, they don't care. Right. You look at like what happened to, I don't know, MGM or Caesars Palace recently down in Las Vegas. Um, okay. People did not talk about, oh, let's talk about the technical fiddly bits of a, of a third party breach of like some identity provider. No, they talked about people who couldn't get into their hotel rooms. They talked about the, uh, you know, people who couldn't use the casinos, ATM machine. We talked about effects. We talked about monetary damages, hundred million dollars in counting. Right. Those are the things that regulators focus on. Those are the things that boards focus on. And I'd say for any CISO watching this, like if you want to know how to effectively communicate your value to the business, find out what are their KPIs, their key performance indicators. What are they measuring executive performance on? And then tie everything you've got to a KRI, a key risk indicator, which is often a lagging indicator, but occasionally they're leading indicators that can then show like, hey, these things you care about. Here's how I am managing my sphere of risk associated with that, which you can take into the rest of your organizational telemetry as appropriate, right? As opposed to, oh, we got 100 million attacks this month. And they go, eh, what? Like, I think we've been presenting a lot of actual, like, factual data to them that they just don't care about. It's nobody needs those facts.